right, some dumb guy here. It's a uh, Thursday and some date in June. It's a guy and his iPhone on a hike trying to find the end of the world. I thought maybe I'd take you all along with me. See if I can make it there. The recent uh, heavy rains have made my usual easy to navigate pass a little bit grown over. I was up here a week ago scouting things out for the first time in like a year and a half and it was pretty brutal up to a certain point because there's a lot of fire roads up here and parts of them have been cleared away. It's a lot of underground natural gas lines so which maybe looks like they might be doing some work up here today. Hold on, let me check. Okay, yes, yeah, so there's a little crew there that I don't know what they're doing. There's two guys standing on top of the hill, just kind of looking off. They waved at me, went about my business. Couldn't see any activity. But as you see, this is the road area that they've cleared out the fire roads and as I said there's a lot of underground gas pipe that they need to service this is the general direction heading top of that road up the hill all right Man, all those storms forcing a long vacation from this hike. Yeah, it just takes its toll. Hard to get back into the into the groove. Uh, but we are nearly there. Well, at least we're gonna turn around, which is uh, approximately a six mile there and back again. It's like that old trail's completely grown over at this point. Would have missed it entirely if I had known it was there. Just another way back down. That trail was never all that user friendly anyway. It's like right there's where they're doing some of that repair work or maintenance on the pipes. Yeah, my phone in my case, my arm arm pouch now. So I'm really hoping my audio is coming through at least halfway decent. Yes, we shall see. Okay, three, three miles in. Okay, the peak, ladies and gentlemen, I give you 
the end of the world.